It seems like more and more people are complaining about having to work real jobs. But I'm only 14, and I have never and hopefully will never have to experience that. But what if I did? Well, that's what I'm gonna do today, or at least the next best thing. I played a video game. And all of this is to answer the question, is a real job really that bad? Again, I'm playing a video game, it's not that scientific. You'll start with a small store and grow into an awesome supermarket. I like that, guys. I like that. Awesome. That was a good touch. Don't forget to set a price with a profit to avoid bankruptcy. <laughs> Yeah, you would want me to do that, wouldn't you? So I'm thinking if I lace everything with, like, black tar, then I'll just have infinite customers because everybody's gonna be just coming back. They can't get enough. All right, I think I just bought one unit and I'm out of money. Uh, like most businesses, though, I started with $50. Good old off-brand, uh, what are that, Cocoa Puffs? I think I'll keep this here for decoration, too. <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. So now I just wait for the customers to start rolling in. Hey, ma'am, let me tell you, you- What the fuck? Don't look, guys. Don't look. What's in the trash? Oh, it's making... Ugh, bro, I wanted my decoration, bro. Set a price for the product. I think we all know what I'm gonna be charging here. Uh, market price, $5.99. How about $5.98? Uh, zero. Honestly, if there's cars like that driving around, then I think that they should be able to afford my shit other... Or, excuse me, ma'am? Really? Look at you. Yeah, get out of here, brokey. We don't- we don't want your kind here. Sir, look, you, you look like you just got back from watching the Big Bang Theory, alright? I know you're hungry. Would you- would you like some, uh, Cho Kippen? Oh, it looks like he would. Hell yeah. Are y'all all just broke? If you don't have five dollars a month- Alright, I guess I'll have to ruin the fucking joke. What do I price- I was pricing it- I'm still gonna price it egregious. I'll do eight dollars. So I'm making five dollars a box. Ninety-two dollars and change, bro? Who does that? Who pays for a box of cereal with a hundred dollars? Does that- I think that means that I should just start charging a hundred dollars each, right? I mean, I'm seeing the opportunity here. What are the controls? Oh, eight. Uh... Who's, uh, what if I were to just, you know, forget the debt? Oh, oops, forgot the debt. This game's no fun. I mean, it looks like these, uh, LA prices are doing just fine, though, because I literally have lines out the door for $8 boxes of cereal. I made $68. That's almost the funny number. Smelvin's back for round two. Is your receding hairline done being a broke bitch? I don't want you in here anyway, dude. You look like handsome Squidward minus the handsome. So just Squidward. That was a good one, wasn't it? I uh, know. Thank you. Tough crowd. Now, now listen to me, sir. Look, you, that snatched hairline, looking great, crispier than a box of cereal. Speaking of that, would you, can I, so what's stopping me from just pricing my cereal insanely high, but then buying all the cereal? So the only chance people have to get cereal is from my store, but they have to pay $10 each. What if I just become a cereal store? What, 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 what if I do like a pyramid scheme? I like how the people here, they either look like this guy or, you know, just the polar opposite, like this guy. This dude looks like he just got Back from work while his wife was getting fucked by the tennis coach. Far be it for me to say or judge this dude's life decisions, but who wears a suit and brought like who just wears a and who pays with a hundred dollar bill to buy an eight dollar product? I should just make that my policy. You know the you know those uh like restaurants that make fun of you? That should just be my grocery store. I make fun of you and my prices are awful. No bias for me, and far be it for me to say anything as a 14 year old who's never worked a real job, never plans to, but uh if this is what the work force is like and this is how easy it is to make money you just get all the 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 40 year old middle-aged white men to come and buy eight dollar boxes of cereal and make a shit ton of five dollar profits off of each of them and i think I'll, I'll i'll fare pretty well in the real world and i mean we we all know how accurate this game is press enter to finish the day hell yeah seven products too expensive uh i think that we can all agree that that was 100 percent their fault they just need to get their money up overall we made 56 dollars uh that's more than i've ever made in a day in real life so i want like the shit store ever. I want you to come in here and have all these ingredients and not be able to make jack shit from it. Flour. I think that's good. I don't know any recipes that are cereal and flour. They don't even have milk. I don't even have milk. They're just buying dry cereal. Cut like 10 rows of flour and, and two of cereal. No liquids. No produce. Ellen DeGeneres strolling in after a fucking three year hiatus. Come buy a bag of flour. Oh, I shit. I didn't even price it. Oh, fuck. I had to close the store. I need to be making my $9 margins a bag. It least okay so 79 i'm gonna charge these at i think about six dollars what's the la price that's what we need looks about right to me maybe i should go wand this dude's fucking tall maybe we should go wander around a little bit try to try to employ some homeless people maybe sweeten the deal with a couple narcotics 
Ah, uh, what a lovely town. The first fucking thing I see is just a wreck. How does this happen? You're literally coded to go in a straight line. How do you mess that up? I love these types of games where it's like, you feel like they probably made it in like a 10 hour marathon because everything's just so underdeveloped. The people all walk with the same animation. Like they, they got somewhere really, really fucking important to be. It's like nobody's buying the flower. I guess $6 for a, a bag is too much. Not really my problem. Sounds a lot more like yours. See, this woman gets it. Thanks for not being a bitch. Now get the fuck. It's cause you're broke. You ain't nothing but a broke boy, boy. Do I have a life outside? Like, does my character have like a plot? Or is my entire life in existence just here to sell people overpriced shitty products? Purchase product license using computer? Oh, I can, I could do water. Does that mean I'll be the only person selling water? Dude, think of the money. If I was the only place in this world selling water, that's what the big, that's what big water needs to do. That's what I think that needs to be like a uh, Walmart's next partnership. If, if one store, if one corporation started selling all the water or like all the like produce, it's over. Nobody can compete with that. How much did I make today? I better have made more. Of course I did. Every single day I'm taking W's and never L's and get that through your brain. Ain't that right, sir? Yes, sir. Also, I haven't mentioned this, but my lips are incredibly red because I just drank Hawaiian Punch. Uh, I don't want to see one comment if I'm wearing lipstick or if I was blowing the Kool-Aid, man. I don't want any of it, all right? Eyes on the game. Eyes on this dude's receding fucking hairline. I don't know what the license means, but it's my objective, and now I have enough money for it, so I'll buy it. Oh, just means I can now sell bottled water. Needed the certificate for that, I guess. Which I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be a water store. Like I said, I'm gonna sell out the market. I'm gonna be the only place in the entire planet where you can buy water. Oh, the product needs a fridge. Dude, I go to Walmart all the time and they don't have fridges. Why do I have to be any different? Bullshit. I'm sure a fridge costs a lot of money too. Mini fridge, double fridge, single, tiny $200 to sell the water I already bought. Get the fuck out. It's closed, idiot. Not my best day. Didn't profit too much, but I... It's also a physics-based game, too. You can tell because the gravity makes total sense. And you think I got competitors? Like, if I went down the sides, you think I'd find another motherfucker trying to, trying to do big... Trying to do big water dirty? Q candy smoke sh... Excuse me, fucker. What the fuck is good, John? Nice five o'clock shadow. Q candy shop smoke crop. ATM inside and cigarettes and more. I, I think we're good for at least another month. Look at you. You look like the dude from Ratatouille. So sorry, <laughs> I didn't mean it. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not really liking the whole workforce thing. Even though I'm working for myself here, which is not what most people who work at grocery stores get to do. I mean, the bitching that I'm getting. I'd rather read YouTube comments of people complaining than like, like if this was in real life, if these people were real, oh dude, I'd hate this shit. This, this is terrible. I'm in a, a dark alleyway. I look like I'm in the Bronx trying to make it out, selling water. Never even seen like my home or my kids. And all I do, I made a hundred dollars in a day is terrible. A hundred dollars in a day? Not even profit? Oh my god. And this is like obviously a million quintillion times easier than it actually would be in the real world. Like in the real world, nobody would be, nobody would be here. Like the, I, I would just literally be sitting wasting my time because I wouldn't get any customers because all I'm selling is bread because I started this shit with 50 daughters. Got dumb and dumber in here. Like I, I, I would just hate this. I'm not meant for the workforce. I don't know about y'all. I think I can buy a fridge though now so maybe I'm on the up and up and I can stop complaining. Wait, I don't have the tutorial anymore, so I don't have to listen to it and recycle. I can actually decorate- Hey, cunt, get the fuck out of my way, asshat. Decorate this shit how I want, and I'll price this shit how I want, too, and you're not gonna do anything about it as much as you wanna get in my way. How's $4 sound, ass crack? Yeah, you already put it in your bag, too, so you just made me $12, loser. This isn't even far off from how much water is in real life. One time I went to the mall, and they were unironically selling a water bottle for $5. And I don't even live in that exp- I live in Texas. It's, like, not that expensive here. Holy shit. Get it off the top. That's how you know it's fresh. Only the best for my pet, my customers. This, uh, this is what I like to call the, uh, the broke boy barricade. Uh, basically, if you're broke, don't even attempt to get past this. You won't. And that's how I want to run my store. An all-inclusive community. I don't know about y'all, but at least my establishment is run pro-pollution. Uh, I will not be recycling not a goddamn one of these boxes, and there's not jack shit you can do about it. This reminds me of that, the, the, in that old, yup, that old game, Hello Neighbor, uh, the beginning of it, where you'd unpack 
pack your shit while you were moving right next to the insane schizophrenic murderer uh, and it all be in boxes that's what this is except this time i'm the schizophrenic insane murderer ain't that right john come in here and complain one more time and see what happens i swear to god if one of y'all walk out of this store complaining about anything good boy can we keep it up good boy See, all I had to do was scare the shit out of my customers, like most establishments have to do. See, my philosophy with running my business is that if I do it so wrong and so shitty, it will succeed. Walt Disney, apparently he'd go around the park and he'd just look at shit and he'd go like, how can any of this be better? Can any of this be improved? I'm gonna do the opposite of that. I'm just gonna make my experience at my store the shittiest possible. And then what's gonna happen is people are gonna be like, oh my God, this store's so bad, you have to go to it to experience how bad it is. And then by then, I'm the next fucking Jeff Bezos. If one more motherfucker comes in here and complains, I'm fucking done. All right, I've had it up to here with these fuck. Are you, that was are, well. After all that, I can confidently say that working a real job is probably a fate worse than hell for somebody like me. So please subscribe so I don't have to ever do that.